Praise the Lord, my beloved people all over the world. Welcome to the Word of God Garden of God. Welcome, 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 welcome in Jesus' name. Yes, what is mommy doing today? Yes, I'm doing my series of organic fertilizer. The ones that I, I make and the ones that I buy to use. So, yes, I almost forgot when I had all the fertilizers that I was going to uh, show us in this uh, YouTube channel, I forgot about this fish fertilizer. This is my first fertilizer that I've used, that I keep on using. Before I started buying so many other fertilizers, this is my first fertilizer. And I like it so much. It's a, uh, it's a fish uh, emotion, fish fat fertilizer. And the EPK is showing right there. It's a 511. Yes. Yes, I was using this Alaska uh, formula brand before I now found this one. You know, this, this one is hydrolyzed. Yeah, this one. Before I found this one. Okay, this one is cold pressed. They made it cold pressed, but this one is cooked. Okay? So this one, it doesn't smell as much as this. You know, but people are complaining, oh, this is smells, it smells. So uh, this one smells like fish, like sardine, but not uh, as strong, you know, smell like this one. But for me, I don't mind the smell, you know, because I, I care about what it does for the for our food, because we want to eat healthy food. And I, I, I care about what it does to our soil, you know, because it feeds our microorganism, you know, all the microorganism in the, in the soil, it feeds it. If you have a, 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 a soil that doesn't have a, a, all those worms and stuff, then it's not healthy. You can't, you, you, it's like it's, it's dead. So that's why we need all this. Okay? So yeah, so you can choose any one you like, but this one, you can see it everywhere. Go, go to uh, online, it's in the, uh, the Amazon, the eBay, uh, where else? Oh, excuse the plane. You know this place is noisy with the plane and and the and the and the wind. So I don't know when it's good for me to to upload my video. So it's crazy here, very windy all the time, and I don't know when this one will stop. You know, flying. So please excuse, uh, excuse, uh, excuse me, please excuse the noise. Yeah. So yes. So this one, I've been using them. And uh, you know this one, then I, I tried this one, but I like this. Okay, I like this one, and it's like I said, you can see it everywhere. This one is not readily available, but this one you can see it in uh, everywhere online, Amazon, uh, eBay. Uh, you can see it, Home Depot, Lost. Yeah, you can see it there. Okay, and it's very good. Very, it's going to be a very short video. They give you how many? Um, they give you. Uh, Okay, what are they talking about? Okay, uh, I just use a, you know, for con for my container, I just use one tablespoon to uh, one gallon of uh, one gallon of uh, water, uh, one tablespoon. That's what I use. And if you use two tablespoons, it's okay. Then, if I want to do a, a, if I want to do my leaf uh, feeding, you know, I just, you know, maybe like a, I just put like a. Uh, half uh, half of the tablespoon, just a little bit. Make sure yeah, the solution is very light. Then you can feed it to your plants. I mean, to your to the to your uh, leaves. But if you want to feed your plant, you can put two tablespoon or one tablespoon per gallon. Okay. So I just uh, boil it. I just take my my uh, my. Uh, I just take my. Uh, You know, you can put it, you know, sometimes I feed my plant using the five gallon bucket. I fill it up, like I said, I just boil it. Or I can use, when I first started, I will use it. You can use this. That is if you put it in another container where you can, you know, siphon it out. You can use this syringe. They have different sizes. Or you can use this. You know how many ounces? If they say one ounce, two ounces, you can use this. But I will always put it in a, in a pocket or a container that is wide. Why? I can just, you know, scoop it. Okay? Or else, I just avoid it. I just take it, I shake it. And then. Uh, this is very thick. 
very very thick so I just uh, you know just very thick see it's so thick so what I do I just it's, it's so thick you see one two I'll just do it like that mm -hmm. all right then I stir it up because it doesn't burn your plant you know I've never had it burn my plant you shake it I mean you mix it up you know and uh, you know feed it to your plant and if you want to feed your folder like I said make it lighter any of the organic things that I show you can use it for your to feed your, your, your leaves before they are feeding but just you have to make it less concentration less so if you are using one tablespoon you're going to use like half a tablespoon so yeah or just make it light use your discretion yeah so yes so that, that's what you do you just water the plant it's easier as abc and if you want to do your uh, 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 foliar feeding you can use you can you know mix it up or mix it in a, in a gallon and pour some here and then you, you, you now feed all your something or you can even use this maybe you, know, you have a house plant you want to visit some people they say it smells so much they can't use it in their house blah 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 I just like it for what it does for the, for the what it does for my, for my plant. Okay, so what does it do? You know, it does a lot of good things. Okay, it's a uh, it's organic uh, based, and uh, it, it has a lot of protein that feeds our soil microorganism. Microorganism, <laughs> microorganism. Yeah, it feeds all the microorganisms. So, and you know, we get a lot of uh, nutrients, you know, from it. It helps us with uh, a lot of, uh, you know, other things that uh, our other um, fertilizer cannot give us. Yes, this one gives us because the fish uh, fertilizer is very good to improve our soil health. Okay, and it, it, it makes all the natural necessary nutrients to, to become available for our plants, and it makes our plant healthy and it's thrive. Yes. So yeah, so it doesn't. It's a, it has a, a, a nitrogen, but it's born free. It doesn't burn the way you use it, uh, along with other primary nutrients of uh, phosphorus and potassium. Yes. So yeah, this is very good. Uh, for what I do, I always use it with my other fertilizers. Like as you guys know, I have fertilizer like uh, you know from a uh, Espoma. Uh, Dr. F, I use all those kind of, uh, and uh, you know, I use them. And uh, initially, when I, you know, start planting, I put my my thing in my container. What I do, I put the granular uh, fertilizer like Espona, uh, Espoma or Dr. X. I mix it up and do all the necessary things. Then, when I finish everything, I will now you know, use this as a final touch. So, because this one will provide the, the, the quick uh, nutrients to the, to the plant to keep it going. Why the other Dr. Ed and the other uh, organic uh, granular uh, fertilizer, they break down gradually over the course of three or four months. Okay, so this one, you can do it every 10, 10 days or just follow the direction. And, uh, you know, so when it's time for you to reapply, the other one you can reapply. But in my garden, once I... I do the initial dressing of my of my plants when I, I, I when I first plant them. Then I use this one once in a while. Then I use my all my other things that I do, you know, banana peels, um, all the uh, brassica uh, fertilizer, the leaves, the kale, the uh, uh, collard that I uh, collard leaves that I I ferment. I use them alfalfa, so I mix them up. So I don't even go back to the earth and the uh, espuma like I used to do before. So less, less. The more you, you learn how to use all these things and make your own, the less money you spend. And guess what? It's about the health of our soil that I'm talking about. It's not about the money to buy the, the, the fertilizer. It's about the health and the organism, you know, the microorganisms, you know, are being fed. You understand? And the waters will have nutrients. And why we put other organic things is for the uh, 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 you know trace minerals and minerals you know we need all those things okay those are things that make your food taste good but if you don't go and just get one kind of uh, product chemical just put it in yes it's, it will grow 
but it's not going to do any that uh, chemical uh, fertilizer will not do anything to the uh, health of your soil and guess what your food will not taste even good and the nutrients and the trace minerals are not there you see that is what even those people anytime you go to the store you buy something that says organic you don't really know if it's organic you can't tell whether it's really organic it's when, when you plant it yourself you know what to put in it okay so when you plant organically then your food is healthy then it tastes good and everybody's happy yeah so so i just uh, wanted to show you uh, you know uh, this uh, yeah i can smell it <laughs> but i don't mind yeah god bless you as you are watching, please don't forget to give thumbs up. Sometimes people watch it, don't give those people. Come on, encourage, encourage, encourage. Yeah, God bless you all. And thanks for watching. And then, you know, you can go pick up your own if you want. Believe me, you will be happy with the, the you see, the way I like it. That's why I bought all this. I even have some more. I just buy them and keep them. I don't want to run out. Yeah. So, yes. So, you just say, uh, pick up whatever you want to do i'm not paid by the company or sponsored but i use them and they, they work so that's why i'm showing it to my to all of you my beloved ones yeah so this is it one more time i want to show you so you can pick up whatever you like yeah and use it any way you like yes okay it's very easy to use it doesn't burn the plant okay so thanks for watching guys thumbs up please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell god bless is always shalom